Buenos días, amigas. It is August the 29th. It is 10.34 and I am currently getting ready to go to work. Ya acabé going to the gym. I need to hurry up because yes, I'm at 10.35 already. Y no me ha lavado la cara. I haven't ate breakfast. Um, so I need to mesh together, like now. I just got my teeth cleaned yesterday. Um, and I don't know if I'm the only weird one, but I like the feeling of my teeth being cleaned, like afterwards. Like they feel kind of tight and shit. Mmm. I'm gonna go ahead and do my skincare. I'm using the face reality. Basically, my whole skincare routine is face reality. Um, this is the ultimate gentle ultra ultimate ultra gentle cleanser. And then I just put like a pea-sized amount. We're gonna um, diffuse this. I think that's the word I want to say. Like that, make it foamy. For a good minute. I usually would use my calming facial toner, but I've noticed that it kind of like burns, not burns a little bit, but stings a little bit when I use it during the day. So I started using that at night now. Um, so what I'm gonna go with in next is my Hydra Balance um, Hydrating Gel. And just like a pump of that. I don't know if you guys can even see it. And that's gonna be way good like way good enough that amount is gonna be good enough for my whole skin i'm gonna bring it up into my neck close to my ears and yeah i almost poked my eye okay letting that dry and then now my moisturizer it is a crown peptide moisturizer um take my skin routine with like a grain of rice when it comes to your routine because obviously everybody's needs are different this is what just works well for my skin okay obviously spf spf 30 i use about that much um there's a rule that you're supposed to use like three times the amount on this but i think so way more than enough and the goal for me obviously is not to look oily because look how shiny i already look so imagine if i was using like three times the amount that girl like i'm gonna look greasy greasy and that's just not the vibe today um, I'm going in with my Glymed lip balm. This is the best thing ever. It like tingles so good. It's peppermint and it has peppermint in it. But yeah, it is so good. So cute looking. I can't. I am obsessed. Now to fix this hair of a mess. I was kind of letting my curls shine through, but I need to find like some sort of like conditioner that's not going to give me this like wild frizz that I have going on right now. It's just not the vibes, girls. Um, but before we get started, let me put some deodorant on before I forget. I'm going to go with one of my favorite perfumes lately. Like, it is amazing. And, yeah, it is the Mod. I think that's how you say it. By Ariana Grande. And this is her, um, it's the white one. So, the, I think it's vanilla. I don't know. Smell good always. So let me brush my my eyebrows, but it doesn't mean not that crazy. I used to have a lamy, but yes, se me cayó. And I didn't lose any brow hair, and that's because I took care of it really, really good. A lot of people love the brow lamination and how it looks, but when it comes to like the aftercare, they don't think it's important, so then they start shedding brows like crazy but when you take care of it right you shouldn't be shedding 
so much because I am wearing brown and a little bit of like gold right here I'm gonna put some gold earrings on um, I like using these little ones and I do have like triple piercings on both sides yeah triple piercings on both sides Get the rice chai. Chai is that pretty. Chai gets that pretty during the week because she knows she has to be put in her kennel when we leave. I cannot trust her. Like, just roaming inside my house because she kind of gets wild um, and starts chewing up shit. She shouldn't be chewing. And instead of me, like, giving her her putazos, I'd rather put in her kennel. And don't get me wrong, she doesn't cry in her kennel. Like that, she just doesn't like it. I think we're just gonna spray some of this miracle. No, yeah, the mirror 25 miracle milk. This has worked wonders for my hair. This is what has helped my hair like be so healthy and hydrated. Um, I absolutely love it, and I think I will use this for like the rest of my life. I just need something to like kind of control, like obviously, the frizz that you guys see in my hair. I'm using a white comb. I think it's called a rake comb. Because this is not exactly going to brush out my hair all nasty and ugly. But it's going to like... Para que no se mira tan feo, pues. Se va a mirar. No se va a mirar, pues. Okay? I'm going to spray some water. Just to hydrate it. And this is going to give like my curls their definition again. I need to go eat and I have less than five minutes. Not even five minutes because then I'm going to be late for work. Honestly, I was going to make some like chilaquiles on camera, but your girl don't have time to make chilaquiles. So this is the fit. I must tengo a brown bodysuit, a brown belt, some black jeans, and then I have these cheetah print um, Converse. They're like half Converse. I don't fucking know. But yeah, and then let's go with the gold earrings. I also just got my nails done yesterday and they look so cute. So let me show you guys how they look. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Let me make sure it's on focus. So cute. I'm gonna I am actually gonna eat some leftover uh spaghetti because I'm hungry and I need something like now. With being on my cut, I was able to eat a lot of high volume foods. When it came down to pasta, I referred to this Heart of Palm pasta. It is so good. It is by Trader Joe's. Actually, I don't, yeah, it's Trader Joe's. Um, but it's not pasta, so I don't want to give you guys an impression that you're going to feel the texture of pasta. But it does give that feeling of pasta. So, I'm going to use this. Actually, I don't even know what it's made of. This is hard to palm, ingredients hard to palm. So I'm gonna let you know But I'm gonna put some spaghetti sauce. I still have some meat over from last night. And then I'm gonna top it up with some Parmesan cheese. And then probably just eat slices of toast with it. Um, because I need the carbs, I am also gonna have a Olipop, which is bomb. I have tried, um, what's the other one called? So there's, I think it's Poppy. Poppy, and then I have tried Olipop. And by far my favorite is Olipop. Olipop does have more fiber in it, but it does have more carbs in it. Um, but I personally think that the flavor is like 10 times more better than Papa, Poppy. Um, I'm not shitting on Poppy, but if I were to choose between one, I, I would always go with Olipop. Hey friends, me fui a cambiar because I decided I no longer wanted to be in my day clothes. show you guys the construction that they're doing right now I barely had enough for the one serving onion cutter I wanted to show you guys these protein bars. Well, not even protein, but they're good in macros. These pumpkin bars I made. I'm like trying to hold myself back from eating them because 
I mean, at first I thought they were like okay, but as I started eating them more, they were actually really good, especially with the Oreo inside them. So it's just a Kodiak pancake mix, and then I put an Oreo on each side, but I added pumpkin pure Greek yogurt, applesauce, I think that's it. Two of them, so they kind of have that chewy texture. Look at this is one of them, so you can kind of see like the Oreo in it. Okay, now I'm gonna add 10 grams of cheese. Oh. Okay. That's 10 grams of cheese, and I'm just waiting for my bread. Let me show you guys my favorite Olipop, the grape one. Oh my gosh, bro. Like, even Juan likes it, and Juan doesn't even like healthy stuff. Like, and especially because this has like, this is basically kind of like a, I don't know. Like, if you compare it to soda, obviously no más a ver a soda, pero it tastes like soda, and Juan likes it too. So now I'm kind of scared that he's gonna end up drinking them because I don't like when he drinks them. <sighs> so good, bro. Oh my gosh. A lo mejor es porque no más tengo hambre. And I'm like, I feel like I'm in heaven. I think I'm gonna watch some YouTube. It is time to go pick up my kids. I'm gonna take Chai with me because. Chai, wait. Wait. Get in the car. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna test Chai's ability to listen because usually in front of like a lot of people, she likes to bark her head off. So I'm hoping, hoping she will be a good girl and um, listen and not bark whatsoever. Um, but like I said, I feel bad putting her back in her kennel when it's just gonna be for like five minutes. Um, because she's been in there all day basically. Well, for like two hours at a time. Um, so I'm like, no, I'm just gonna take her with me. Chai, you doing good, girl? Sit down. See, this is what I was afraid of. She just... She's not aggressive. Chai! Stop! Stop! She's not aggressive, but like, if she sees like people she doesn't know, obviously she's gonna want to like like seem like she's like very protective and i'm like bitch you're like a chihuahua stop barking we secured the kids we are now going home how was school fabian it was great how was school mateo good yeah yeah i missed you so much <laughs> yeah we missed you so much mom i missed you guys too ffr what i got the two wrong look it's okay, you did good. You got a lot of right. Be the last one not to get to go. No one on your We got home and we're going to a little bit, but the kids want a sandwich now, so sandwich with chips is the vibe for lunch. Mateo! Ben! You want cheese on your sandwich? You were eating chocolate, huh? Finally, 
So guys, before I came home that first time after work, I actually stopped at the youth ranch, which I have not gone thrifting in like so long. I kind of gave up on thrifting a while back, like a year ago, because every time I go, I would never find anything. Um, so I decided this time, I was like, what's something on the left, said, let's go to um, over there. And I actually found some things, but ultimately I ended up putting some things back. I was like, okay, do I really need this, bitch? Like, you don't need to be spending money. But this shirt did catch my attention. Look how cute this is. Like, it's kind of ruffly at the bottom, oh, but like kind of loose. The straps are ruffly, and it's so cute. Like, look at the look at the pattern to it. It is so cute. And I only paid four dollars for it. But it's from Shein, so of course, <laughs> of course I was gonna like it. And honestly, it probably cost me fucking four dollars, four dollars off Shein too. So I paid probably full price for a fucking thrifter shirt. But it's okay, cause it was cute. Yeah. Now I'm debating on what we should have for dinner. What are you guys, what are you guys craving for dinner? Um, I know. What? Yeah, yeah. You're creepy. Should we have pizza? Yes, yes. Personal pizza? Yes. Mm -hmm. Perfect, we are having pizza for dinner. I know what I was gonna do. I was gonna make a ninja creamy. So I'm gonna make some ninja creamies, and in this household, if I have to eat, well, if I eat a ninja creamy, apparently everybody in this household wants to eat a ninja creamy. <laughs> Boys, do you guys want a chocolate ice cream tonight? Yes. Alright. Do we have pineapples? Pineapple again. Please. How about chocolate? Okay, well then you and Jack can share your a pineapple one and then Mateo can have a chocolate one. Ooh, that is so good. Okay, yeah. Bomb. Bomb, bomb, data bomb. So excited to eat this. Put these in my deep freezer because in my deep freezer they get frozen faster than in my regular freezer. Um. Okay, yeah. So I won't have to start the pizza until like 5.30, right before my husband gets out. That way it's at least fresh and hot for him. Other than that, I think I'm pretty much done for that day. I think I might have the kids start their homework here pretty soon. That way we're not doing it so late. Okay, while I'm doing nothing, let me just make sure my fitness pal is fully updated with everything I have eaten so far. Um, a thousand five hundred and sixty cows. Hold up, wait a minute, that doesn't seem right. Okay, apparently, everything that I have consumed so far, plus my Ninja Creamy, it puts me at 711 calories for everything I had today. Um, which is honestly not that bad, and I feel like I've been eating the whole fucking day. Um, but I have 149 cows left. Hi, Chai. Um, I have 68 per, uh, grams of protein to go, 86 grams of carbs, and 23 grams of fat, which is a lot, bro. That's like two meals right there. Let me add in my pizza right now. That way I can figure out what's the next move for me. I'm here as well. I'm going to update my health chart and my pee tracker chart. Um, both of them I use it to track my ovulation and my um, period. That way I do not have to use a birth control. I absolutely hate birth control. Both the times I had birth control in it, I absolutely hated it. These are the dates I had my period right there, the red ones, and then 
the little green dots ones shows when I'm supposed to be ovulating. So it shows that this week I'm supposed to be ovulating. So this is where I want to be careful. And then it'll give me my exact date of my ovulation. The little flower right there. Which is September 3rd. And then it just goes on through the, throughout the next like month too. And it shows me like when I'm supposed to be starting my period after that. And it's just amazing. Honestly this video... I'm going into detail with this app and this video is not sponsored. So, until they run me my bag, I'm not going to show it anymore. Or just <laughs> but then, um, if you have an iPhone, your iPhone actually comes with an app called Health. And it also will track your period for you. And, yeah. So right now, like the blue for them, it shows that I'm ovulating. And then the red is when I had my period. And I'm just going to track everything. It shows like symptoms of what I'm feeling. I am going to start making dinner and we are going to have pizza like I said before. Pasta sauce going to each one. Put some garlic powder. Oh, salt. Now I'm going to go in with a little bit of cheese as a first layer. So I just added pepperoni, chicken pepperonis. And I'm gonna go ahead and put more cheese on this pizza. Yeah. So there's one pizza already done, the yumminess. I'm just popping it in my air fryer. And I got this air fryer at Costco like about two years ago. I tried looking for it the other day, but they don't have it no more. But they have other air fryers, which knowing Costco is probably just that good too. So the temperature is 400 at um, 10, 400 degrees at 10 minutes. Now I'm gonna prep the other one. Look at that, bro. You can't tell me that doesn't look good because it looks good, it smells good. Ugh, I wish it's freaking focused, but yeah. So beautiful, so good, so delicious. Oh my gosh. girlies yeah it's what i love me so we are gonna do my nightly skincare routine but first and foremost i am gonna take my vitamins this is selenium Selen it's a selenium i like taking these and then i like taking these probiotics and prebiotics as well this is a toothpaste i like to use the sensodyne pro enamel don't ask me why, but this is the one that they recommended my husband to use for his teeth. And then ever since, we've just been using it. I'm going to use the Their Breath Mouth Rinse.
Now para peinarme. Just using my rake comb otra vez to detangle anything out. I am ready to go to sleep. It is now 9.23, which gives me about one more hour before I completely go to sleep. So, that's perfect timing. I feel like my day went pretty quick. I'm not gonna lie. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this whole video. I know it's kind of very mellow. Um, but if you like it, please give it a thumbs up and comment what more you would like to see out of me. Thank you guys for watching. I'm so used to this.